listen to me. Them same kids that you go above and beyond to make sure they have everything. Them same kids that you put your life on the line for. Them same kids that you go to bat for every time could be the same ones that turn around and kill you. Literally. Check this out. Bro, man from Chicago was sentenced to 99 years in prison after paying a hitman to murder his mom so he could empty her bank account and live the lifestyle he always wanted. According to the reports, a family member told the courtroom his mom would give him anything he wanted. She bought him expensive clothes, jewelry. She bought him a Mustang sports car. But it's like nothing she ever did was enough for him. It's like he always wanted more. On the night his mom was murdered, his girlfriend drove with the hitman to her house and shot her to death while she was asleep. The hitman then called the 22-year-old to let him know the job was done and he told the hitman, turn around and go back. I need you to make sure she's dead. And the hitman went back to his mom house and stabbed her already dead body. At the funeral, one of his family members said he didn't show no emotion. He didn't sit on the front row. He didn't even go near her casket. And I thought that was weird, but I was like, hey, maybe he just processing things different. One week later, the 22 year old recorded himself withdrawing more than $90,000 out of his mom account and throwing hundreds of dollars in the air, even giving away money to random people. On Instagram, he posted a picture of him at the Burberry store with stacks of money at the cash register and another picture of him on side of his Mustang in a Versace leather jacket. He was even seen bragging about how he spent $1,500 on puppies. When asked by the judge if he had anything to say before being sentenced, he told the courtroom, I just want to say this. Nobody loved my mama more than me. She was all I had. And that I say this all the time. You can give these kids everything. You can give them the world. You can be the best parent in the world. They're humans. They're going to make their own decisions. They're going to make their own choices. They're going, to be, they're going to be influenced by different things that's out of your control. Here it is. This woman gave this child everything. Everything that he ever wanted, asked for, needed, because she worked her behind off to make sure that he was straight, like the majority of us parents. But what a lot of parents fail to understand is this. The social media. No matter how good of a parent, no matter how much you try to teach them, this social media will influence them more, will have more of an influence on them than you ever could. For likes and clicks and to be accepted, these folks to do things huh, that you never could imagine that your child doing. And a lot of people may say, now, nah, oh, no, nah, that couldn't be my kid. My child wouldn't do that. Do you think that she thought that her child would be the one that unalived her? Don't put nothing past these kids. I don't put nothing past my kids. I try my best to be the best parent that I can be for them. But at the end of the day, I know that they're going to make decisions when they're away from me. They're going to make choices just like we did when we was children. It's a sad situation, but I'm going to let y'all know. These kids ain't like us when we was growing up. They not like us for real.